Hi, I'm Jay Steger from Cold Country Vines and Wines. I'm Kay Steger. Today we're going to talk about the Wine Club release, which is... On March 5th, not tomorrow, Saturday, but March 5th is a week from tomorrow. Okay, um, we think we got some very exciting wines to release this, this time. I know they're exciting. Oof. And for this release, who gets, a, who gets wine again? So this release is for any member of the Sweet Wine Club who receives the spring and the fall sweet wines along with the Combo Club members who chose to be in the club that has both sweet and dry. <laughs> The Combo Club is both clubs. It's a sweet club, the dry club. So at the Combo Club, you get a combination every three months. You get a combination. You get a combination. <laughs> Which. <laughs> and we haven't even been drinking yet. Uh, all, right, <laughs> all right, now we're going to take these out of there and we're going to show you what we have for what this. What do we uh, have in the box? Club release. Okay. Under door number one, we have the da -da -da, Frontenac. Everybody's favorite. Yep, Frontenac, uh, that is, that was our number one selling wine for two years in a row. So I know you guys like that one. And of course, Rock Legend. Who can't look forward to the bubbly, sparkling yep. Rock Legend? This next one I'm really excited about. Before we go to the next one, let's talk a little bit about the Rock Legend. Okay. We actually dedicate a whole weekend to Rock Legend in the summer. Mm. It's our Rock Legend Music Festival, mm -hmm. and that is dedicated to that wine because it's a, it's a free, light, I mean, it's not free. <laughs> it's, it's a, a light, light, sparkling, fruity, sparkling, lively wine, and uh, so we have uh, a fun. number of uh, musical guests for a whole weekend here, and that's dedicated to the Rock Legend wine we make. And this is on the Niagara Escarpment, which is a rock. Which is basically a big rock. <laughs> 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 All right, let's uh, reveal. Last but not least, drum well, roll, please. Winemaker, let's let's hear about this winemaker. All right, well, creation of natural. Cold Country juice. has never produced a pure fruit wine before. But this time, and this this isn't filtered yet. This we're going to uh, we're going to do a tasting for you right now. This is going to be bottled uh, in a couple of days, and uh, peach. We're going to do the tasting now. This is a peach wine, natural and, uh, peach. Oh. So um, we did have a few samples earlier, and we think this is the winner formula, and for those of you who don't know us very well. Kay and I do a lot of bench testing. We, we do. enjoy bench testing very much. We do, and as he mentioned, it isn't filtered yet, so there is a little bit of uh, haze to this, yeah. but. It'll be crystal clear when you guys get it. But what Ooh. bench testing is, bench testing is we, uh, we experiment with the formula, and we'll do like anywhere between two and five or six different blends to see exactly uh, what we want to do for a finished wine. And we'll change things like uh, sugar content or sometimes we'll reduce the acid a little bit. But anyway, we do a lot of testing because we like our wines to be very well balanced. And, uh, and one thing we found when we poured wine at the Wisconsin State Fair this past summer is the number one most popular Wisconsin sought after wine was hmm. peach is so this is not a fizzy wine but it is peach that's a it little disappointed sweet. in that i mean we're we're a state now that grows a lot of grapes so uh i know all you guys who go to the state fair next year i wanted you to vote for a, a grape wine <laughs> this is kind of what is behind the story as to why we chose to do a peach yes. wine yes we uh we are going to do a couple of uh um fruit wines per year now and the main reason for that is uh Cold country, and this is this is our motto. We want to be the one winery that serves all your needs all the time. So, you guys have stated that you like uh, walk in the some door fruit wines. Do you so, have any fruit wines? Yeah, we're have gonna any have fruit some. Wines? We will. Okay, so let's right. do a little taste of this. Okay. So, uh, first off, Oof. 
cling peaches oh, yeah. that I just yeah. opened. I just got smashed in the face with a peach. <laughs> 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 That's the one thing we won't have to do too much of on this mm. tasting because I'm pretty sure this is going to taste like peach. <laughs> okay, so a very smooth, smooth, mm. sweet flavor, S sweet aroma. Wow. Sweet summer cocktail. Mm. Oof. It's got that little finish that's like, it, it's just like when you uh, when you swallow after eating a, a fresh peach. picked peach. Yes. yes. And so, the fun thing about this is you can make a cocktail adding a little bit of spritzer water mm. to give it a little carbonation. Like I mentioned, this is not carbonated, but I can see we're adding a little carbonated water with oh, yeah. this. Yeah. You can so add it to your yeah. <laughs> you can add it to your peach smoothie if you're into the health health scene and you make your vitamin uh, shakes in the morning. Add a little peach flavoring. I I think this is very impressive. Hmm. Well, anyway, as you can see, like Kay said, it's a little bit cloudy. That will all be cleaned up in a couple of days. It's yummy. And uh, yes, we are behind. Uh, we just like everybody else, we're having supply chain problems and. Uh, our label suppliers uh, need two months notice to get their stock so that they can print their labels. And well, uh, No blame there, you gotta blame us for going on vacation because yeah, we yeah. went on vacation and that threw us back a week. So <laughs> unfortunately we aren't releasing February 26th, but March 5th is worth the wait. It took two and a half months to get labels. Uh, I'll rest my case. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mm. All right. All right. Peach. Peach. Happy Wine Club. Cheers. We'll see you next time.